Well, we're joined here on Morecambe Player with the Commercial Director, Mark Dixon. Mark, uh, thanks for joining us. It's, it's been a while since our last catch-up. We've got a lot going on at the moment, uh, from the fantastic coach and ticket offer to Coventry in the FA Cup, to the uh, cracking offers in the club shop at the moment. Just give us a flavour of what's yeah. happening. Um, we've been uh, delighted with the uh, response we've had to the coach packages. Um, the update to, uh, right now is we've got 40 places left. Uh, there is a point at which we do have to cut it off, um, so I would urge everybody who's thinking about travelling to give us a call, pop into the club shop Tuesday, it's open between 10 and 6, or give us a call on 411797, uh, option 3, leave a message or you'll be straight, straight through to Graham Fagan, um, leave us your details for collection on, on Saturday from uh, from 9, 9.15 in the morning. But as we sit right now, there's 40 places left on uh, on our final coach. Right, how many coaches have we got? That'll be four from the football club official and two from the uh, from the fans uh, travelling. So that'll be six coaches in total going down. Excellent, and lots of independents too. It should be a cracker day. Uh, fantastic. I mean, they usually say you'll you'll take just over double what you do on coaches. So we're probably looking at between seven and eight hundred travelling to Coventry next Saturday. Excellent. Can't fantastic. wait for that. Can't yeah. wait for that. So what's happening in the club shop? The club shop, obviously. Um, those that were at, uh, at the Globe on Saturday will have hopefully seen and heard or on the radio. We've got a 25% uh, Christmas sale on. Um, the majority of our replica and uh, summer wear, shall we call it, uh, is 25% discount. Wow. And uh, we've also got the new stock in the gilets, the sweatshirts, the uh, drill tops for the, for the winter market, for Christmas presents. Lots of stocking fillers. Um, I'd urge anybody to get down there for if you've got a shrimps fan in the family. Yeah. Some nice stuff down there for, for Christmas presents. Well, 25% off, that's pretty generous. Well, we've got to, I mean, listen, Mark, you know as well as I do, it's all about what people have got to spend these days. We can't, we're not going to sit in our ivory towers and, and think that everybody's just going to come here. We're, we're very, very conscious of what people have got to spend um, all over the place. Um, it's all about deals, and we're more than happy. If people come and support us, we'll keep the deals going. Excellent. I'm sure everybody appreciates that. Uh, back to the match day side of it. We've, yeah. we've got a couple of matches coming up, and then we've got a big one on, uh, on <laughs> New Year's, Year's Day. Day. Yeah, we've, uh, we've got a little bit of a, little bit of a, a quiet period, that some people would say. We've got three <laughs> weeks holiday, haven't we? Um, before, the, uh, before the Oxford game, one o'clock. Please don't forget. Yeah. One o'clock, fifteenth uh, against Oxford. Um, two o'clock against Dagenham on the twenty-second. Um, there's a few offers going on hospitality. Um, you know, from thirty-five pound for a two-course meal. People want to give us a give us a ring. Um, we're really, really happy with. Um, you know, we had a hundred in against Wimbledon on Saturday. Fantastic atmosphere. Um, so we're hoping similar numbers for both Oxford and Dagenham, but. It's down to the supporters to come and support us on that. We'll, keep, we'll as I say, we'll do the offers. Um, if people got a bigger group, give us a ring. You know, we're prepared to. Uh, I've to got to say, I've only ever heard positive comments about the the, the corporate side of it here, about the hospitality. Uh, everybody that comes on the match day, you know, actually says what an absolute bargain it is. People, uh, I mean, Monday morning, uh, funnily enough, is quite a, is a good day for me because we have the management meetings, but. Just reading the emails, we always get emails on Monday morning of people who've been to uh, the ground on the Saturday. Uh, we had four or five uh, ground hoppers uh, doing the 92 um, who came, who chose Wimbledon on Saturday. And I've got four emails this morning, you know, thanking us, saying what a fantastic experience they've had. Uh, there's a couple of blogs as well, I think some, somebody will find the links somewhere Excellent. of people who have uh, been, you know, extolling the virtues and, and telling us what a good day we put on. So, yeah, it is very positive. Very good. So, New Year's Day then. Yeah, New this Year's Day, there's a, there, is a, there is a really, really big message to get out there and, and we're calling on, on all Morecambe fans, Shrimps fans, to really get the message across. It is all ticket. Um, it's something that, that the police have, uh, have come to us with. They're very, very s strong on this message. We must get it across. People have to buy the ticket in advance. There will not be a ticket on sale past six o'clock on New Year's Eve. Right. We will be open. We will uh, reiterate. We will advertise um, the, uh, the Christmas opening between Christmas and New Year. It's something we'll have to do. We'll have to bring staff in specially to do it. Um, but it's part of being a football league club. Um, one or two might say that, well, we've said all ticket before and then on the day we've opened the gates and we've sold 
I, and it, it's a fair question, you know, and it's been it's been levelled at us uh, through a few different quarters, and it's understandable. Yeah. Um, but on uh, this occasion and going forward from here on in, if the police advise that it's all ticket, we really don't have a choice. Right. The police, the police advice, um, Black, uh, Blackpool, <laughs> Bradford have their tickets now. Yeah. Um, I don't know when they're going on sale. We went on sale from Saturday. We sold a few. Yeah. Obviously, we're concentrating on Coventry. Um, we will. They're there. People can come down and get the tickets now if they want. But from every time the shop is open, Bradford tickets are on sale, and you can get them. But. <laughs> Yeah. The danger is, I suppose, that on New Year's Day we get a lot of casual people turning up who don't normally come. They're not regulars, yeah. but because it's New Year's Day, it's a bank holiday and what have you. So it's, it's getting word out to them. And this is what I say. This is, you know, the Morecambe fans, uh, uh, you know, the club will do our bit. We'll do the radio advertising. We'll do the newspapers. We'll do the posters. Mm. But it is word of mouth. You know, yeah. if you know somebody who comes to a Christmas game, the once a year, the twice a year, the, the guys who come for the bigger games, being bank holiday, please, please, please get the message across to them. If you see them at work, if you see them in the pub, if you see them wherever, they must get a ticket up to the game. Up to the end of uh, the business on New Year's Eve, they must buy a ticket before. Okay. Well, speaking of New Year's, we had some fantastic offers on, on the full season tickets at the yeah. beginning of the season. We did the perfect 10 as well, yeah. which was well received. Are we, are we any plans to do half season We are doing a half season ticket, which, which will run from the Aldershot game forwards. Um, just check the, uh, check the website, check advertising. Um, over the next week or so, we'll get the information out there. Um, but it will run from Aldershot onwards. Another great Christmas present deal, maybe. Another great Christmas present deal. Um, there's lots out there. We're, we're, we're chuffed a bit with, uh, with the response we've had to our December to Christmas parties, which, as you know, are all full up. Yeah. Um, we're delighted with the response of the, the local community and the business community who are coming to have the parties here throughout December. Um, as I've said, there's the, there's the discount in the shop on, on Markham merchandise, but again, that's one some, something that... People might want to buy for a loved one who's a Shrimps fan, just a half season ticket, which you'll take into account every home game from all the shot onwards for next for the second half of the season. Well, a lot going on, and uh, thanks for your time. Really appreciate it, and we'll we'll come back again and talk to you in the new year. Thanks for coming back and uh, and having a chat. Great. Cheers. Cheers.